Ah, uh, fuck you! You're a bunch of pussies and fags! Nice! I'm going back to the meeting! Good! I'm going to be somebody! Yeah, yeah. See you later, Mel. You always were an asshole, Mickey. Hey, watch where you're going. Hey! Hey! I tried to tell you. Fuck you. Excuse me. Позвони мне, когда закончишь, хорошо? Sorry, when I see you later, okay? Yoko, Fetty Roman's cousin. <laughs> What's your name again? Big Mouth Prick. Very catchy. Sit down. Cousin... Uh, Nico. That's it, Nico. Not Big Mouth Prick. You funny guy. I try. Yes, and this one's. I'll let you take the shit out of me. Take the shit? Yes, me give out. I don't understand. Ah, people who fuck with me get fucked with. Okay, fine. Calm down. Whatever. Some old man not paid me in months, and I'm not kind of person who is treated this way. Old bastard owns a china shop in the Campton Avenue in Dukes. Here you go. Don't hurt him. Just teach him a lesson. I don't need a bat to teach a lesson. Hey, let me in. You have Vlad protection money, old man. Big Vlad and his protection money? I'm so scared. What I need protection from? You think this door is going to save your shop? There's shit I can break out here. Vlad should pay me to tell punks like you to go away. He get no money. Shit, brain. I pay up now. I pay up. Shit, here. I thought Vlad and I had understanding. Only thing I understood was you owed him money.
Hey, Yokel, you managed to do the job? Get Vlad his money? He paid up. I had to smash the shop up pretty good, but he paid. Don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. That it? Can I go now? Sure. Get out of my face. Nico, how you doing? Fun. You know, Roman, I haven't been having that much fun since I got here. Has been a lot like hard work. Well, you should hang out with your cousin more often. Maybe that is the problem. <laughs> I'm sitting here with Brucey. Well, we're sitting here and calling the cops and watching them show up and look around. The fucking stupid bastard. You shouldn't cry wolf, Roman. Who knows when you really need help? Fuck! I think they see us. Have to call Nico. my cousin, I want you to use family business how you like. Anytime you want cab, you call me. Thank you, cousin. That could be very useful in this city. You're going to have your license revoked. What? My friend, smoking in a bar is a crime. Plain and simple. Well, you're joking, right? This is a joke. Yeah, you're playing hey, a joke on me. Hey, Mallory, right? tell Fedek his cousin is okay. He just walked in. Great girl. Yeah? Stay away from her. Of course. Now listen. You did good with the business the other day. But now one more peasant is trying to avoid pain. Who? Moskovsky jerk who owns the laundry in the Masterson Street. Thinks in this country business is done differently. Says he will call cops on us. Okay. So? Jerk needs to be taught a lesson. Give him a beating. Let him know might is right. Hey! Stop that smoking back there! Bushel! Easy, Wait. buddy. Did you hear Go on. Do what you gotta do. But remember, you see a cop? You don't know me. I see anyone I don't know you. Ho, ho. Hello. Vlad говорит. Да, да. Что ты хочешь? Быстрее. Я очень занят.
I have a message from Vlad. Shit! Stay away from me! Okay? Why have you not paid Vlad the money you owe him? I'm going to. I've just been having the trouble getting it together. Vlad is impatient man. You will be getting the money to him soon, or your wife shall be using your washing machines to get the blood out of your clothes. Do you understand? I do not ask twice for a favor. I understand. I will get it to her. I thought this country was different. I spoke to the laundromat owner. He gets the message. He will pay you now. I like your style. You can be an intimidating guy. It's a shame everybody knows what a stupid yokel you are when you open your mouth. Huh? Come back to the bar soon. Запомни, если хочешь сделать деньги, приходи Where are we going? To my car. Why? Because of your cousin what? owed me a lot of money, and until he pays me, you're fresh off the boat. Yeah, your ass is mine. What the fuck you mean, why? Hey, you are a pretty relaxed guy, huh, Vlad? Come on! Panovinsya, starai vedmak! Come on, Yoko! What's wrong with you? You gonna jump me? No, I had a late night last night. Spent it with Mikhail. Great. Yeah, wild! Yeah, I guess you're right. That's so who the hell is Mikhail? Hey, Mikhail's the man! Shit! My nose is bleeding. Is my nose bleeding? No, not yet. Fuck this. Come on! Wait! I'm walking hey, here! Wait the Let's fuck go! Up. Damn city, always trying to run you down, huh? Hey man, can I borrow Get that job, hey, you deadbeat crackhead! Just a little change, man! Man, hey, where do these people whoa, get off? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Like I'm gonna pay for their drug habits. Well, say something! You are so fucking laid back! Moron! Come on! Want some? Good. We walked all the way over here so you could snort coke? No, listen! Ah, that's better. Huh? That's better. Man, Michael gets the good stuff. It's got some laxative in it, though. Gives you a stomach problem. <laughs> nice detail. Yeah, listen, huh? Where were we? I don't know. Oh, yeah. So, I need you to head up to Duke's and get a car for me. It's a silver blister. And it's packed in the projects by EIC subway station. Okay? Sure. <laughs> you yeah. got keys? Uh, no. Yokel, I need you to take the car. Asshole owes Mikhail some money. Take his car instead, huh? We are gonna <laughs> drive over there? What? Are we gonna drive over there? No. 
You're gonna take the train, buddy. You think I wanna be in the car with the peasant? Come on. I'm gonna go meet somebody. <laughs> Have a little <Okay>. party. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Have fun, bye, bye. dickhead. This car belonged to Vlad. No, it's mine. Who asked you? You ain't gonna jack Jimmy's car off, you son. I'm gonna put you to sleep. I have your new car, Vlad. It's not pretty, though. Real dirty. Dirty? I can't sell a dirty car. I know you cousins like them dirty. Maybe your whole yokel family drives around in the dirty cars, but it's not the way over here. Fucking peasants don't do nothing right. Hey, I could fuck this car up worse than a little dirt. Relax, man. You should lose your age. There's a car wash over on Saratoga Avenue. Just to take it over there, and then to my lockup, just up Mohawk. Did they give the car up easy? He's a little bruised, but he gave it up easy enough. Good. Dead guys can't pay interest. You are learning.
receiver's answer phone message. Be leaving a recording for me after the bus has been played. I put the car in your lockup. You're not as stupid as you look, Yokel. Come back to see me at the bar soon. Kazi, hello. You want to go for a drink? Hopefully the booze will not make me lose my sight in one eye like that stuff back home. Get me in next hour. I am coming to get you, Roman. Let's go! Abandon, you did okay. Kinda looks good. Girl I'm taking out tonight is going to be impressed. She won't be impressed with the way you look, so clean car is good thing. Later on. Oh my gosh! And me, the big man, let's hustle. I cannot believe you are here with me. Really, I can't. It's hardly been a lot of fun since I turned up, cousin. Correct. It has been a fucking nightmare, but that's not the point. No? No. The point is, fuck it. The Bellic cousins are here in a land of opportunity, and we are making trouble for any fools who get in our way. If you say so. I do say so, man. I do. I just did. It, it, it's good to have you here. Whatever shit we get into, man, it's good. Thanks. Don't you miss home? You've been there a long time. You never get homesick? Sure. I miss things about home, but I, I, I think things are ruined now. Yes, I know what you mean. I miss the good times we had as children, when our fathers were too drunk to beat us, when there was food and the sun was shining, but now, now I live here and life is good. Is it? Yes, cousin, it is. Sure, this place is crazy, but so is home. And here it is okay to be an eccentric go-getter businessman with a taste for fine women, wine, and song. <laughs> is that how you see yourself? My god, you are deranged, cousin. This place has made you sick. Fuck you. I'm an individual, my friend. One of a kind. Or, to put it another way, a freak. See the way that man was looking at me? Did you see him? An ex-boyfriend? Fuck you! Fuck you, Nicobelic! He was looking at me like he wanted to fight! Like he thought I was nobody! I am a somebody! So, so... So, so what if I moved here? Everyone except the Native Americans are immigrants to this country. I don't even know you were meant to have walked here from Russia when the sea was frozen over. I didn't know that. Stick with me, cousin, and you'll learn a lot. A 
about games of chance, about hard work and opportunity, about pleasure and women. Hell on the head. I need this. What the fuck? I'm gonna I bust you up. I can barely walk or think, let alone drive. Hell on the hell of a lot. What did that scumbag think he was staring at? I'm a continental lager. He's just a domestic brew. Tastes like fucking piss. Everyone loves an imported and classy beverage. If I knew where he lived, I'd go there and seduce his Where you wanna go, Hefe? Take me to Iroquois Avenue, please. Nobody knows this city better than me. Hey, I... This is it, my compadre. We're here. Thank you. I'll catch you around and be calm if you want to hang out again. <laughs> <laughs> 